Brother Jonathan's topic is you love your brother, loveth his brother, abides in the light. And his text is 1 John chapter 2, verse 10. He that loveth his brother abideth in the light, and there is none occasion of stumbling in him. I want to focus on the phrase, abideth in the light, because it shows that you're not going to go very far in loving the brethren if you're not living in the light. And so this shows a permanent residence, not just a passing, you're not passing through the light, you're not uh, just visiting the light, you are living in the light. Now to abide means to dwell, to continue, to stand firm. All of these words have bring with them the connotation of a permanency. Uh, you're not planning on uh, moving from this place. So this verse is speaking of those who have made their residence in the light. Now, those who are living in the light do so because they love the light and they have been able to see, they've been given to see the benefits of being in the light. Those who live in the light have a hatred for darkness. They have an aversion to it so that they're not going to desire to leave the light, to go back to the darkness. This is, so this is not a, a brief encounter, but rather a lengthy exposure to the light. Now the light is going to have one of two uh, effects on those who are exposed to it. The one, will it will reveal the wickedness that is present. And to the other, it will reveal that their deeds are wrought in God. Mm -hmm. Amen. <clears throat> only those that love the brethren, you will only love the brethren to the extent that you are abiding in the light. Mm -hmm. And in order to abide in the light, we must be transformed. The natural man cannot abide in the light any more than we could live in the water or in outer space. We just simply don't have what it takes to live in those kind of environments. Like the natural man doesn't have what it takes to live in the light. And so the Lord has made provision for this. He has made a way for us to be transformed into new creatures that are able, not only able to live in the light, but have a desire and a drive to, to move towards the light. <clears throat> now, in the case of this verse that Brother Jonathan is going to be expounding, the light is going to reveal who you love. And this is very telling. If you love the brethren, it's because you love the light and you see the light in them. If you love those who walk in darkness, it's because you have a fellowship with those who walk in darkness. So this is, this is a very telling who you love. And I'll read the verse again. He that loveth his brother abideth in the light, and there is no occasion of stumbling in him. Brother Jonathan's now going to come and expound this further for us.